Right, this is a cutting tool. There you are. There's a cutting edge there, look, which disappears on a little pivot. You can adjust along here how deep you want the cut to be. So you put it in like that when you turn it. That's gone out of focus, but anyway, you get the idea. So let's turn to the boiler. So you pop him in one of the holes, like so. It'll obviously turn backwards quite happy. If you turn it forwards, it catches. And then big socket. And you push down here the noise as it starts. And again, it's reasonably difficult to push down, but with a big socket bar, it's not a, not a big problem. Would help if I wasn't holding a camera. You can hear the creaking noises. Almost there now, I think it's. One revolution you have to do. Get the, there you go. It, it'd be easier with two hands. And then, and again, ah, there we are. You hear the crunch, and you see it now turns quite easily. And you turn it backwards until it frees up, and then you pull it out. And what you probably can't see. Oh yeah, you might be able to just about see inside the boiler there. I zoom in. There you go. You can see in there. There's some I did earlier. But as I said before, I'm a, a sub-aqua diver and looking in there, it looks just like the boilers that I see on the seabed. So that is the cutting tool and it works extremely well.